We've been a couple for almost six years now and... Six years is September. We actually started writing music together before Carmen even became a real mm -hmm. thing. Oh, eight, I think senior year of school we started doing some mm -hmm. stuff together. But it was Thanksgiving two years ago. We were sitting in a bus station in mm -hmm. Lowell, Massachusetts. Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving Day. And I said, you know what, Nick? We tried to play in all these other groups and do all these other things and we don't have 100% control. So why don't we just start our own group? You get one of those wooden boxes and play drums on it and I'll get a guitar and we'll learn these instruments and play our music for the world. I think the Look At Me Now cover definitely, I mean it boosted our subscriber base by tons and that was definitely an aha moment like wow people really do dig it when we rap. Um, but before that it was a pretty slow and steady growth. You know, starting from the very beginning we would actually write down the numbers in a calendar mm -hmm. and keep track of how many subscribers we gained each day but it was pretty slow and steady so not really an aha moment there more more yeah, like we, that video that went viral that kind of right and then other people because of that video people found the entire channel including yeah. like originals and then other covers yeah and uh, i think we felt like we had something different and we're excited to have people watch it we had a lot of fellow YouTubers that kind of inspired us uh, along the way and made us really want to make YouTube kind of our home and our base for where everything started. My old boss at berkeleymusic.com, Dave Kusek, showed me Pomplamoose, which is this, actually a couple and a duo mm -hmm. um, that makes really unique, um, what are they called, video songs. So they show everything that's happening in the music. And they really change up the different arrangements of the Oh yeah, and well. it's not just a cover, they recreate the entire song. Which is something we felt we could do too. So we usually like to upload a, at least a cover a week and like an original every week or every other week. And we're really sorry we <laughs> haven't been able to lately just because it's been a little bit crazy. You're allowed to be mad at us yes. and we will make it up to you. We yes. have a lot of amazing ideas and I think it's just a matter of being able to sit down and Having more than three record and a half it. minutes. Right now I, I sit down and I hit. Yeah. Every time he sits down somewhere, he falls asleep. Yeah, they drool everywhere. So as, soon, so as soon as he gets a good solid eight hours of sleep at night... We'll do it. We'll do another one. Well, there'll be ten and new it, videos. And it may even sound good. We want to do songs that are current. And we want to do songs that people are familiar with, obviously. And really, um, kind of, either ones that we connect with a little bit or ones that we felt like we can really change up a lot. And then we, so we look at uh, Billboard, you know, the charts. So those are always a week behind. They show you what happened last week. So it's sometimes something that might be really popular last week will not be, you know, that week or the next week that we usually get the cover up. It usually takes, what, two or three days for us to turn around a cover usually? Usually, between two and three days. Because so. it's a lot easier. We, since we do everything live, it's we, once we just have to learn the song and then we just have to start pumping out takes. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, and also iTunes. We look at the iTunes chart. Look at iTunes. And we try to do songs that people wouldn't expect, really. Right. Um, we've done some in the past where people are like, well, they would definitely cover Firework because he plays piano and she sings. And it does okay. You know, it, it's, um, we changed it up enough to where mm. it was unique. But we usually try to find songs that are a little different. We this welcome the haters with open arms because that's it's... That's how it's going to be. That's how it's going to be. They, they create conversations around us, and we yeah. really appreciate that. I think a lot of people hate on something even if they do like it, and some people, you know what I mean? It's, it's very, the psychology behind hating is very interesting. As long as they saw the video and they're commenting on it, yeah. that means they had some kind of reaction, and that means that we've won. We're here live with Amy. Amy, is it true that there might be an album in the future? That's right, Greg. We are so excited to record an album because yeah. we have all these songs and all these ideas. And new songs and new things that you guys haven't even heard yet, but we cannot wait. But that being said, we want to do we want to do everything actually yeah. right now. We want to go play, we want to go around the world. We have a crazy, awesome, really supportive international fan base. We wanna go we wanna say hi, we wanna like actually meet these people and yeah. play for these people. Honestly, what we can say from this and from the reaction we're getting from everywhere is that our fans are crazy. And that is a good thing. Yeah. We love them. We are the luckiest people in the world. In the whole world. Honestly. And we want to make ridiculously awesome music for you for many, many years. Yes, sir. We love your tube filter. Can we even say that?